good afternoon. Okay, I just want to check how many people are sitting after lunch and we're exactly at the hour. And the hall is almost empty. So I think those everybody to just settle down and those who are going to fall, give us uh, 30 more minutes. The good news is that we have to save about 15 more minutes. So the session is meant for 60 minutes. We will take uh, 30 45 minutes. And out of the 45 minutes, this side can talk about 30 35 minutes. And that side should talk for about uh, 8 10 minutes at least. So that's the format. So thank you very much uh, for. Um, your time and giving me the opportunity to be here talking to the esteemed panelists. And uh, so the first part uh, is a small housekeeping announcement. Uh, those who are, if you have taken the phone call or anything, I request you that go out and take that call so that you don't disturb others. And uh, we request your patient hearing uh, uh, for 30 minutes, as I just said. The first part is we quickly go through a quick introduction. So each of us will take, uh, say, about 30 to 40 seconds. Thirty to forty seconds, not more than that, and everybody will get a chance. And uh, we'll start with you, Mr. Patil. We need to for work. Yeah, good afternoon. Uh, this is Manoj Patil from Technical Solar. If, some, if anybody is having a doubts about the residential sector, like uh, subsidies or special procedure, because I'm sitting next to the one of the biggest guy in the MSC design in the background of the industry. So uh, you uh, may feel free to ask any question about this, and your uh, uh, questions will be rightly answered. I hope. We can, we can. We just just your introduction and your company introduction. Good afternoon. This is Dr. Santosh Patil from MSCDCL. I'm here to just uh, give the ease of business for all the solar uh, sector uh, agencies. Thank you very much. Hi, good afternoon all. I'm from VW. Uh, I'm a banking and finance partner with Luther and Luther Offices. Thank you. Hi, I'm Abhishek Kordin. I work as Chief of Staff at Tinmax. So I work with the Global Rooftop Operations from our head office in Mumbai. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Karan Chopra. I'm MD of Chirai Park Private Limited. We are an EBC company based out of Maharashtra uh, and we are into residential, commercial, and industrial segment. Thank you. Good afternoon everyone, this is Rhonda Kutkan, uh, Managing Director of Kalpa Power. Thank you. Hi, good afternoon everyone, I am Durgesh Manu, Director at uh, Sunny Fry Energies. We specialize in the development and EPC of uh, solar power plant, mainly for commercial and industrial consumers. So, this is Prajit from Mahindra Sonarvice. So, I had the technical for Mahindra Sonarvice too. Hi, good afternoon all, uh, myself Kumar Kawa, I am Oran and Madoc P. Indra. Uh, we are mostly into consulting and services for make printing, open access, as well as we are related to the content. Thank you. Yeah, good afternoon all. I am Rahul Nalavde, heading Panama Renewable Energy Group, who are majorly into wind, solar, and complete uh, end to end service provider. Uh, my name is Gautam Das. I uh, am the founder of Ujan Cleantech. The company is co founded by the IT from the other name. We are bankers, engineers, and lawyers. I worked with Citibank for about 16 years. As a director in Citibank. Today we execute projects across 20 odd states in India and we do country projects including funding. Selectively we buy projects and uh, maybe in country for little longer period we own the assets and total deployment so far is very close to 900 crore. And our uh, EPC as of now, as you said, I mean, we are installing across the board. As on today, it's about 18 states and there will be about 20 odd states. So, as I said, your bankers, engineers, and lawyers in the team. Uh, very, very fortunate to be with uh, uh, people from Transcos and Discoms. Uh, very, very fortunate to be with uh, very, very dynamic entrepreneurs, uh, the asset owners, and team banks to be here. So, we'll keep the discussion in three parts. First, the ecosystem. I mean, India is like 30 crore household, which is 140 crore plus population. And anything the entrepreneurs can solve the problem, that's the biggest business, right? But the whole journey is to turn the problem to ourselves, right? So, sustainable business should be sustainable, and that's the basic thing which is required in any ecosystem. Otherwise, the young entrepreneurs will leave their job, and the young brain will work together, the uh, people will continue to struggle. But as I said last time, the return on your time investment, which is routine, is return on your time investment is not there at times, and people don't realize. That the customer acquisition cost is too high. You take 100 people in the market, you can get maybe 5 or 6 people, right? So, before we go to that, we'll talk about quickly about the 
ecosystem, anybody can start there and whoever is not talking about them. The policy is are very, very critical for growth and of course Maharashtra the state has done exceptionally well. The total adoption in Maharashtra is much much better than many other states. But there are still policies, be central or, or state or ALMA, not ALMA. In a growing, economy, growing ecosystem, the adoption is the most important thing. You can't say that pay the Chinese talents are not allowed because of extra education. That's a valid question that you should not uh, made in India and all this stuff. Uh, but of course, whether you will give incentive to the uh, other manufacturer or will say shut down full stop to somebody and later on say yes. So there's a lot of uncertainties are there. So I'll go to uh, Ronan first, uh, Kalpa Paul. I mean, your comments quickly, our ecosystem. What is going on and, and what do you what do you do together? Sure, thank you. So um, I truly believe business works with continuity, and that is supposed to be uh, a much longer term, uh, a longer term glide path that should be given to all businesses to work with. Uh, there, so there is definitely a glide path. There is definitely a path to go and grow. Uh, but the aberrations that come in between are actually sort of causing a uh, causing a wrench in the entire ecosystem, and that's where we need to iron out, work well. Uh, overall, definitely positives. I think last year has been great about Make in India, ALMM being implemented. Uh, there are positives about how the how the adoption of solar has changed, how uh, the awareness of solar has changed. I think we were speaking a couple years ago about awareness. Are people really aware about solar? Are people aware about the benefits of solar? So no longer are conversations on benefits. It's about how can you get it done, what's the best way to get it done. And are you sure what you're doing today will be valid tomorrow? And that's one thing that's sort of causing a lot of heartburn to everyone. I think uh, we are at a rooftop panel. This morning there was a utility scale panel. And I think Maharashtra is at a precarious state where we are pitched one against the other. And uh, something has to be done soon. Otherwise you're going to see um, you're going to see customers just stalling and waiting. I, I myself have more than I think 10 plus customers equating 20 25 megawatts who have installed rooftops previously. Now want to go ahead and do something better or more and are stuck because of the conundrum that has been placed in front of them. So, um, again, as an ecosystem, largely positives, but continuity of policy, continuity of direction is something that's essential. So, that's uh, my two cents here. Excellent. Uh, one more agenda in mean, cooperation from the discom and transforms are very, very important. If it is rooftop discom, it is essential because without rooftop, it is uh, an entity, it may not be feasible. Similarly, it is open access, for example, like a project in Naku will bring the power from the morning of it. So, responsibility of the role of transforms are very, very important. We'll go to Mr. Uh, Patil and uh, we'd like to hear from you that uh, what can we do together, how can we help us? Okay. If it's Maharashtra, I, I would like to uh, share with you the crisis in Maharashtra, most probably. Okay. Uh, may I? Yes. Yeah. Uh, Maharashtra has a potential in solar solar project. Basically, Shambhar Takke, I would consider it a little bit of a Anshi Takke is a market that is only for the rooftop. And the rooftop is a market that is basically about 2 kilowatt plus 10 kilowatt per year. Typically, there are such a market. 10 kilowatts are above, that's the residency is there, so that you don't have to have a limit, you don't have to do it for 2 kilowatts. Basically, that's the second part of the day, and that's the residency. The residency is there, and that's 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 the policy is there. It's a little bit lengthy, and that's the residency is there, and that's the residency is there. पूर्वी जैसे वो बड़े लगा है सा काम करता हमने ला रेट बिट्री में ला क्यों वो परेशान आर्थर नहीं है जा बिगड़े लेवल ला तो आर्थर नहीं बता रहे कि दूर जा रहे हैं जैसे वहाँ देखें सिक्के ली अतः एक तेज रीड भाई ने वहाँ दे तो प्रोजेक्ट टोटली इस्टोल होता है और जैसा वहाँ दे पर जैसा मुझे बीस पर टिपिकली मिडिल सेक्टर पर तो बोल रहा हूँ तस्चा पर तो नहीं काम करें तो प्रचुर तो बहुत बिजनेस इधर आए प्रत्येक अपन अपना मोबाइल जिन्हें स्टोर के लिए अपने अपने कॉन्टेक्ट्स जिन्हें के लिए ना अपन कमिंग कमिंग एक मेगावाट सब जो प्रोजेक्ट्स अपन स्वतः चार मोबाइल में तो करूं शक्त महत्वपूर्ण जो सोलर वाले काम करता है ना महत्वपूर्ण विषय में ऑपरेशन मेंटेनेंस आए 
जस्टिसचा आहे जसं की मला श्री रावणसाहेबांबरोबर बोलतो हाच विषय झाला या गोष्टी ऑपरेशन मेंटेनन्स मध्ये क्लिनिंग हा पार्ट जर आपण व्यवस्थित मेंटेन केला तर खूप साऱ्या गोष्टी आपल्या आवाक्यात येतात आवाक्यात कस्टमरला लवकर मिळतो त्याच्यामध्ये स्पेशली अजून फार कमी कंपनीज आहेत ज्यांनी क्लिनिंग वर स्पेशली सोल्युशन दिले तर व्हेरी फ्यू कंपनीज दोज हु हॅव कॉन्सन्ट्रेटेड गिव अ सर्व्हिस फॉर द क्लिनिंग सोल्युशन आई रिक्वेस्ट आई रिक्वेस्ट आहे सगळ्यांना की तुम्ही क्लिनिंग वर मॅक्सिमम भर द्या कस्टमरचा आरवाय जो आहे तो लवकरात लवकर येऊ द्या की जेणेकरून त्यांना आरवाय मिळेल आणि आपल्याला बिझनेस पण मिळेल आणि सगळ्यात महत्वाचं म्हणजे सोलर साठी आणखी चांगले दिवस येतील अशा थँक्यू सो मच सर वॉट यू महावितरण म्हटलं की मला मध्ये कुठे ना कुठे एखादा शब्द स्टार लावण्याचा येतोच आणि त्या परिस्थितीत आम्ही बघतो पण मला नक्की हे सांगायला आवडेल जर तुम्ही मागचे दोन वर्ष बघितले असतील तर खूप सारा थॉट प्रोसेस मध्ये चेंज झालेला आहे सोलर इंडस्ट्रीची ग्रोथ झालीच पाहिजे सस्टेनेबल डेव्हलपमेंटची गरज आहे युनायटेड नेशन त्याच्याबद्दल बोलतोय वर्ल्ड त्याच्याबद्दल बोलतोय लोकांना ज्या अपेक्षा आहेत महावितरणकडून तर लिमिटेड ज्या काही स्कोप आहे तो स्कोप आपल्याला ठेवावाच लागणार आहे शेवटी आमचा जो तो बिझनेस आहे तो सोडून द्यायला येणार नाही म्हणजे सोलर इंडस्ट्रीजच्या लोकांना बरोबर आहे की त्यांना वाटत साधी की सर सोलर साठी तुम्ही पॉलिसी मध्ये इथे थोडस लिनियर भूमिका घ्या थोडस हे करा ते करा पण जेव्हा आपल्याला तीन करोड कंझ्युमरचा बेस सांभाळायचा आहे सकाळच्या सेशन मध्ये जर तुम्ही ऐकलं असेल तर नक्कीच लोड कर मॅनेजमेंट किंवा या सगळ्या गोष्टी ज्या आहेत रिन्युएबल इंटरमिटेंट आहे तुम्हाला जर साऊंड सोर्स पाहिजे असेल तर आपल्याला कुठे ना कुठे त्याच्यावर जावं लागतं त्यामुळे आता जर तुम्ही म्हटला एक जस्ट एक्झाम्पल घेतो की सेवन्टी पर्सेंटचा एका ट्रान्सफॉर्मरला लिमिट आहे इथे बसलेल्या प्रत्येकाला असं वाटतं की ही चुकीची गोष्ट आहे गुजरात मध्ये असं चालतं तेलंगणाला असं चालतं असं लोकांचं म्हणणं आहे पण समजा मी तिथे जे नेटवर्क लावलेलं आहे नाही जस वाहन बाई इट्स कम्प्लिटली टू दॅट यू टू प्रोटेक्ट युअर बिझनेस आय जस्ट वन क्वेश्चन यू लाईक टू आस्क आय एम डिपेंडिंग ऑफ दिस इन द सेम इशू अँड टेकिंग पॉझिटिव्हली आय मीन ऑफ कोर्स थिंग्स इन महाराष्ट्र इज मच बेटर देन मेनी अदर स्टेट्स आय वुड से हाऊ डू यू ब्रिंग प्रेडिक्टेबिलिटी इन इट इज ओपन ऍक्सेस प्रोजेक्ट दॅट my asset is in the state for example 100 crore uh, but the willing and information the permission there should be turn around time uh, as i said it's much better but bringing predictability for an entrepreneur or an asset investor is very very important so other will be quite elephant my carry cost of 100 crore asset per year is be minimum say 12 crore rupees in a year even in month we lose it's one lakh rupees of my carry cost which is unproductive completely so how how do we improve definitely we are improving into that uh, we have started from as my uh, colleague said the awareness is there i don't agree with that 100% because when i go around to the rural area and on the other areas where there is a lot of potential for the solar energy as you told there are 40 crore households if i am not wrong 30 crore so the business will last till the last person will get the solar roof down so definitely there is a huge potential and a longer uh, span of uh, working is there uh, awareness is not completely yet only few areas of some of like pula where there is definitely uh, it is a top of the town but if you move on some areas uh, there is a need of awareness that is one thing to answer your question we are trying to improve our ease of doing business definitely uh, for pula why if you has given the award the reason is uh, we started we have started a video session video channel for educating the consumers as well as my engineers now there is a uh, lack of one point which every uh, solar uh, seg- uh, segment agency is missing we are dealing into the distribution work so we are not the solar industry experts my section officer my field officer so i am working as a bridge but it is not possible to reach out to everyone so today i am requesting every stakeholder of the solar please have a meeting we will try to educate my people also so that 
तुमचं जे म्हणणं आहे किंवा प्रत्येकाचं जे म्हणणं आहे की खाली गेल्यानंतर आम्हाला उशीर होता हा ओपन ऍक्सेस असू दे किंवा तुमचं नुकतं असू दे जी काही सोनाची पॉलिसी महाविद्यालयाची संबंधित आहे तिथे आडवणुकीची भूमिका नाहीये तिथे माहिती नाहीये आणि म्हणून आमच्या सारख्या लोकांनी काम करत आहेत की आता जसं तुमचं सोलर पॅनलच्या बाबतीत एक्सपर्ट आहे तिथे बसलेले एक्सपर्ट आहे माझं सेक्शन ऑफिस तर काही फिल्डच नाहीये तो इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजिनियर आहे बरोबर आहे पण त्याचं काम काय लाईट आणणे बंद पडली तर चालू करणे वसुली करणे त्यामुळे त्यासाठी मी इथे या डायसोबत पुन्हा एकदा आवाहन करतो की ज्यांना तुम्हाला ह्या विषयामध्ये खरंच आपला बिझनेस पुढे जायचा ऍज राईट सेड बाय मनोज हा बिझनेस तुम्ही आणि आम्ही सगळे सोबत केल्याशिवाय पुढे जाणार नाही आमच्या साईडने मी ओपन ते कॉल करतो की ज्याला कोणाला वाटतं जिथे अडचण आहे आपण सोबत काम करू आणि तो इज ऑफ डुईंग बिझनेस अजून वाढव कनेक्शन <laughs> The project breaks within three years. I mean, we can be selling very close to thirty percent, and it's exactly three, four, five times of India GDP at times. So, not doing solar is actually trying. But still, I mean, the asset guys, of course, they pass on split the thirty percent into the consumer themselves and and comes down to and the cost to the ecosystem. So, if you are building an asset and if you get, say, for example, twelve thirty percent return or fifteen percent on average return without no cost uh, loan. Why should we run so much of uncertainty and let's put the money in future fund and see that? So what is the I mean, thought process behind that? We are building a portfolio, but there are a lot of uncertainty. The uncertainty of our risk is very high. Yes. So how do we operate? I mean, why do we do so at the first place? In that Basically, first thing is stick to our mission. The Green Max mission is to provide clean power to commercial and industrial customers. So we are very clear with our mission. We have never entered any other segment other than Commercial and industrial. With regards to return and answer ID, return versus answer ID. So I cannot give you the numbers, but what do you, what estimates you get, you have given, we are little higher than that. So definitely it's a profitable business, and due to profitability, there is this motivation to continue. Okay. So and one more thing is that now the challenge which we are facing, right, and like you rightly said, there are a lot of. Clients who have installed solar are coming to us and saying that we want to stop the rooftop operations just because we want to go for a month. So this is the biggest challenge which we are facing currently, and that too particularly in the state of Maharashtra. So, sir, I would like to discuss with you separately how we can address this challenge. Absolutely. Great. We will go to Mahindra Sustain now. I mean, they are also on the largest developer and uh, investors. So, how do you mitigate the risk of operations? I mean, when you build a build an asset, you are putting a, uh, I mean, either a rooftop or 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 say open access. There are a lot of operation risks. How do you mitigate that and where do you get your thought process? So, uh, especially for micro solar, we are mostly doing this. We are doing a self-open access projects for micro solar. Can you tell me about the purpose for self-open access for self-open companies? So, uh, from the operational perspective, if you see what is the daily installation part, so that the EPC pairs uh, uh, complete the project within the timelines and meeting the timelines and the very customers, for, for, especially for the CIO space. But second part is that post installation, we have like uh, electrical commissioning, but post operation, there is a uh, point where we need to license for the necessary approvals, if it is for a net between or if it is for a open access approval, there is always a timeline for uh, taking the uh, approvals and to get a synchronization certificate. Mm -hmm. But what is happening is that you know, there is already a timeline which is defined in the commercial process, but it is not being like that. It is not being like that. It is not being like that. But when you compare to other states, there are some examples which you need in other states where there is a different timeline to say meeting what they are in the system. Already digitized and they are following the digital platform. If there is a new way to happen, then it is always being converted back as a device from another way to another device. Especially because we are asking one, will we find the discount or why you are not giving the necessary permission to do that? 
So it's such a system is not uh, actually seen in Maharashtra, especially. But I think uh, the uh, process we improving and as I uh, see and mostly from the future, maybe, maybe the uh, all the process we can more smoother and we can handle the project within different time and because it's all effect the easy costing at the end of the day. Uh, my my one of the asset of course that is challenge about ecosystem. But designing and selecting the proper hardware is very, very critical. I mean, unfortunately, so like we are ready to kill, kill each other and fight for the price at the cost of quality. So, I will to my friend from Panama, saying, How do you make a balance of winning a project versus which I mean, competing with somebody and having the best quality? So, as you must have seen earlier, also, we are very optimistic people. And uh, in fact, we as a India team, we are very interesting. The entire thing over here as uh, the right? So, by taking the theme, although we have you know the principles and values of each of the organization, we always follow three things. So, one is purpose, passion, and profit. And ultimately, it depends upon all the stakeholders because uh, even to get all these three pieces uh, achievable, the contribution of each of the stakeholders is very important. So, while making each of the pro project profitable or uh, towards a business sense, then definitely all the parameters need to be, uh, you know, since, you know, even from the identification of the technology or finalization of any of the project and towards implementation and delivery of the project, this theme need to be followed. So, what we have followed basically, even for, although we are talking about rooftop, but just to give you the example of utility scale, like other than us, other side of the chair, there is one more stakeholder, major stakeholder, which is basically the landowners and farmers. And if you are seeing, there are many, when it talks about Maharashtra projects, then people always talk about right of issues, local issues, and lot of the people. So we always believe because we have executed many of the projects, and once the landowner or farmer is getting paid as per his satisfaction, or you know, whatever the regular values or rates are there, then definitely. The major stakeholder once you get satisfied, and then the project will get very well implemented within timeline. So that timeline is very very crucial for each of the project, ultimately which, which will convert into the profit. And to make this certain, we have to take care of all the aspects of selection of the technology and the construction of the project, and then uh, basically commissioning uh, within the time with the help of all the utility board because their role is also very very important for giving uh, the approvals. Other day I was actually speaking with Power Sir some time back. And I was talking to him that many of the rooftop as well as utility scale projects, although the projects are ready in all uh, respect, but it takes at least 45 days or 60 days, or in some cases more than 60 days to get final approvals to synchronize the project. And that is actually the loss of the, not of, it is not only the loss of the company or not of the loss of the optical, it is loss of the utility models. 